guys. So, um, um, I, I had to make a video, reaction video, especially for this. Um, I couldn't watch it live because I had a midterm, but I am now watching on the YouTube channel. I do see the name that it's called the Nintendo Switch. So, uh, I'm excited. I am excited. Um, and we're going to do a little live reaction and some thoughts, initial thoughts, uh, after I watch the video. Before I do get this started, if you guys do want to help me out, um, obviously you can see I'm not prepared for this, okay? I had two exams this week and a five-page essay, and I have a crap ton of cosplays to get done in two weeks for Yomacon. Yomacon is in two weeks. If you want to do me a huge favor and help me out for a contest to win a... A uh, photo shoot for one of my cosplays I'm working on. I'm working on Subasa Orib from her Carnage form from Tolkien Mirage Sessions, Sharp FE. All you have to do is go to the link in the description. If you have a Facebook page, like my photo in her pinned post for the contest. That's it. Just like my photo. And, you know, it's first place is currently 50. So if we can hit that, I think we can hit that, and it would really help me out. Uh, it's just basically for me to get a photo shoot from this photographer. So it'll be really, really awesome if you do that. Do that. If it's after October 24th, uh, you don't have to do it. So it ends uh, October 24th. Uh, so just the next four few days after I post this, uh, definitely go and hit that like to help me win. Anyway, so <laughs> plugging me to try and win a contest. Let's get started and watch this. For the first look at the Nintendo Switch, I'm excited! Ah! So it looks like we're, on, we're in a San Francisco uh, street. Ah! Oh my man! Oh gosh, I cannot wait to see more of this. I'm doing a Breath of the Wild Link cosplay for Yomacon too, so. So we are getting another tab. Oh wait, wait. Oh my. So we're sticking with the tablet. And it is mobile. Oh I can take it with me. <laughs> and it is cartridge based. It's true, it is cartridge based. So basically, it's like, they made, so they kept the concept of the gamepad, and they made a lot thinner. Oh my. This is awesome. You know I'm buying this day one. You guys know I'm buying this day one, obviously. And that was Mario Kart 8, so is this backwards compatible with the... How's the... I have to think, how's it going to be backwards compatible with the Wii U games? Oh my god, is that supposed to be the new 3D Mario? Oh my gosh. So they make it easier to be portable and take your stuff with people. Or to do groups and stuff like that. That is great. Splatoon! Oh, I'm, just, I'm just trying to figure out how they're going to do backwards. Uh, is there going to be backwards compatibility? Or are they just releasing the library digitally? Or That's what I want to know. Uh, this is a, honestly, this is a fantastic trailer. Those look new. Those look like new designs. Those are those look like newer Splatoon designs. 
So obviously we need to get it. We're at, hopefully we're still getting a sequel for Splatoon. We need it. Oh my gosh, I loved it. I loved it. Sorry, I'm a fangirl. I loved it. I loved it. All right, all right. Uh, that was the end. All right. Okay. So initial reaction. Um. So like, I'm gonna be completely honest. When I w have been on social media and everybody would talk about the NX and talk about like um, rumors and everything, I would take them all with a grain of salt. I didn't get overly excited over anything. I didn't think that, like I honestly, I don't know how to say it. Like I didn't, I kind of see why they still continued with the tablet and mobile thing, uh, mobile thing for gaming. So yeah, um, I mean I loved it. I loved it. I honestly loved it. Um, I just really am excited for the games now, but I just, I really hope that, um, that we're, my main concern is making sure we can still have, is having third parties on board. Um, I, I mean, I honestly like the idea of like the controllers being able to, you could switch from just doing things on your home console and then taking it literally with you. Um, so I just, it makes me wonder like, so when you're playing at home, like if that base also helps with like graphics or if it does help at all or if anything downgrades when you actually just do take the screen with you on the go uh that is something i definitely have a question about and how that's gonna work um but yeah i'm excited i think i i really i fangirled there for breath of the wild link um coming on screen for screen breath of the wild but like and then as well getting the looks with new splatoon characters so i feel like that's like an insinuation that yeah we are gonna get a beginning a Splatoon sequel, um, and then as well, like, new images for 3D Mario, so hopefully we get a look at the new 3D Mario game soon, because I am very, very excited for that. I am uh, curious about a price point, because I guess it wasn't actually announced in there, um, so, price point, like, I think if, around, sticking around 350 maybe, 350 for, a, that would be my, that's my guesstimate for a price point, um, but yeah, I mean, yeah, I'm buying it day one, um, no matter what, because I'm, you know, I want to be able to have the new console when it does come out. I'm really concerned about backwards compatibility as well, how that's going to work. Um, if you're only going to be able to play the backwards compatibility, like if they'll have, like, on that base, um, the CD slot, or, you know, the disc slot for you to put in um, your Wii U games and such, um, if you'd only be able to do it at home. Um, so that is definitely a concern I want to know about. Um, or they're just going to re-release, um, games for the NX, um, from the Wii U. Alright, so, that was my initial thoughts and reactions. Um, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you for my next video, and everything will be starting back up as normal, like normal, on this channel after Yomacon, which is after, um, the last, the first weekend in November. Um, I will be probably doing another announcement video, uh, to let you guys know about Yomacon and what I'm doing there. Because uh, I'm doing a lot of panels and stuff. Alright. So yeah. I'll see you guys for the next video. Bye.